on Pure Country Yaks tonight. Another short horror film. Uh, this one is called Passenger. And Lexi felt like this one was good enough to stand alone. And yes, we saw it last weekend. And yes, it had no sound to it. So we're doing it again. But she says she wants to keep the ones that she thinks really deserve to have the spotlight. And they will be done on their own. So this one is Passenger, as I said. Um, I want to go ahead before we get started and say thanks to our subscribers. We appreciate it. And um, make sure that you remember to hit that thumbs up at the end. All comments are welcome. Um, as long as you don't attack us personally, we're okay with that. So without further ado, let's go ahead and look at Passenger. Enjoy. Sometimes it takes twice. I hope it isn't misplaced. I'm not worried about that. Stop here, Margo. All right, Lamont. Yeah, he was getting sleepy. No. Remember what I told you? Straight for that lamppost in front of us. I know. Cut your wheels or you'll sideswipe. Remember. Maybe he's got to where he's going. Doubt it, though. I'm sorry, but I wouldn't park in an abandoned area. I would have parked in a parking lot at a grocery store or a gas station. I see some cars off the way there, but where, where are you at, dude? You're just pulling off the road to go to sleep. Okay, I, I understand. Are your doors locked? Seemed like something sort of kind of knocked on his car, didn't it? I don't remember hearing that last time. Yeah, get out and look. I, they ain't nobody around. Dude, are you crazy? He's crazy. He is parked in an absolutely deserted place. Somebody can murder you. And, yes, like Lexi said, why are you getting out of your car? You know ain't nobody in your darn trunk. What are you doing? There was a body in there. You done got rid of it. What are you doing, dude? Like your car doors. I tell you what. He could even get a hotel room. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Yep. Can't get a crank. Definitely paranormal, especially when your car don't want to crank now. She's probably going to be in there the next second. you knock? What's that about? I guess he's trying to see if he's still in reality. Oh, there goes your trunk. Oh, she's kind of doing like a grudge thing. Sure is. Hold on, now I can't even get out of his car. Uh. I thought his trunk had came up. Was it closed again? I thought his... Okay, I'm losing my mind. Or I, I don't know what's going on. I don't think they showed it getting closed. But it, it did open. It did. Okay, I want to make sure. She's going to be in the back seat. Oh, look, and his car crank. She's got to be going now. You need to get your seat up a little bit more, dude. Yeah, there no. she is. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Alright, so hopefully you see why Lexi said this was a standalone. She didn't want anything else with this one. She liked this one. I, I liked it too. It was pretty good because, I mean, he was doing everything wrong. <laughs> yeah, he parked in a deserted area. Didn't like he locked his car doors. Um, getting out of your car in a deserted area. You know. Um, and then he didn't even sleep. He just... Since she was there, I mean, heck, I'd have moved too, but still, like Lexi said, if you gotta have sleep bad enough, make sure you're in, like in an area where there's a bunch of cars and people and stuff. And I know it was late at night, but that means parking lots and things like that. There's 24 hour places you can you can park at because a lot of Walmarts are that way, or grocery stores are that way, or hey, 
Go get a hotel room. I don't know, but I want to sleep in my car, especially this day and age. You don't never know what's lurking around outside. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but um, we hope you enjoyed that. Again, that was called Passenger. And if you hadn't done it already, please subscribe, share our videos with friends and family. Please don't forget to uh, hit that thumbs up at the end. And until our next video, peace.